Hey everybody, Michelle with Michelle's Frugal Living here. Thanks for watching my videos. Today is April the 12th of 2017 and continuing my series for new couponers or people who want to learn how to coupon. Um, I want to talk about internet printable coupons. Okay, so there are thousands of places on the internet to get printable coupons some places and I say that because um, like lots of individual companies have coupons to print and um, and not just like these type of manufacturer coupons but like maybe even um, restaurants and places like that so um, if you're looking to save some money at any place that you're going, go to that company's website and look and see if they have coupons to print, okay? And um, it might um, say coupons or um, offers, uh, stuff like that, okay, on their website. But I'm going to be talking about um, manufacturer coupons um, that you use at the grocery store or at um, drug stores, places like that. Okay, so um, the big one, um, coupons.com. Oh, and I should say, even on coupons.com, you'll find um, coupons down here for um, <laughs> the other things, uh, you know, stores or whatever. Okay, um, so the, here's the the coupon descriptions, and you just touch them to pick the ones you want to print, and it tells you up here how many you're gonna have to print. So, like, I got four of them selected right now. And um, when you go to print, mine looks a little bit different, so I can't really show you. I'm not going <laughs> to um, change this on my computer. I have the old printing software on this computer, and one day coupons.com is going to get rid of that. Um, and if you don't have it on your computer already, what happens when you hit print, it pops up a screen right here and asks you to put in a phone number. So you have to have a phone number you can get a text message at. And then it gives you a verification code, and you have to put that verification code in, and then you can print. And you can get two prints of a coupon with one cell phone number. Basically, that's it. It doesn't matter if you switch computers. It's not going to let you print it again if you've already printed them with that phone number, okay? Now, they print three per page, so you try to do them in lumps of three so you aren't wasting paper. Um, but anyhow, that's what it looks like. I, I I I can't show you the phone number thing on this uh, computer, but um, once you've printed it one time, the like here's the YoPlay one that I just printed. Um, it shows up down here. I'm, I'm scrolled all the way down to the bottom of the all the coupons, and you can see where it says limit reach. Some of these have I've already printed two on this computer. Okay, so if you're looking for them, they they fall down at the bottom. So coupons.com. Um, another one, redplum.com, and then I go to here, right here, where it says printable coupons. You, they have load to car coupons available here, too. And this one will let you do one print <laughs> per computer. And um, so, like, I already printed that Gliss um, coupon, so there it is right there. It does three per um, uh, piece of paper as well. And, um, yeah, and you just pick them which ones you want. Um, some of them are regional by zip code, and so you might have to touch on that and put your zip code in. So when you um, pick them to print, and then um, you click on print, this pops up, and then you want to print the coupon now. And then this has got to install, um, I because I already printed tonight, it already has it on there, but it has to install a little program on the computer in order for it to print and then there it goes to print <laughs> okay and it's not going to come out because I need to change my color cartridge okay anyway so you have to let it install that software on your computer or it's not going to print now smartsource.com um, whoops this one has um, you can log in and get more coupons like these um, these Glade coupons, and I tried to print them, and it told me they weren't there anymore. Um, yeah, it thinks I'm Jill, <laughs> which is okay. So, um, and you can click on view more coupons. If you log in 
you will see more coupons than if you don't. And these, you can just pick what um, what coupons you want now and just selected it. Um, and it prints three per page. Here's some that I printed. And I've had so much trouble trying to print some coupons tonight. It, it, um, I lost the prints on the coupons I wanted. So, um, you know, you can pick, I guess, if this is, it's being a little bit slow. Hit the print. And this one needs Adobe, um, PDF reader on your computer. So it, it downloaded the coupons. I'm going to say open. It opens up Adobe. And then um, this document is trying to print. Allow it, yes. So you have to tell it you want it to print. And then um, here's a list of things that I've printed <laughs> from this. And um, yeah, so then it'll come out the printer. And then it tells you it's printed. This one you can typically print too coupons but sometimes I have trouble and um, <laughs> it only gives me one. The coupons on these websites they um, come and go they have limits on how many times it allows people to print them I mean like people anybody can print them so there may be like 10,000 prints available and when that runs Ooh. out the coupon runs out I got an error for printing here and um, but sometimes they reset the coupons, and you will you can then print them again on your computer. And it just varies. And typically, the coupons show up on Sundays, and then really at the beginning of the month is a good time to come and look. But I'm on coupons.com just about every day looking to see um, what new coupons there are. Um, Healthy Essentials is Johnson & Johnson's coupon printing uh, site. And you need to log in, and these you can print one time. And these, it takes maybe six months, a year before they reset and let you print them another time. And um, uh, pgeveryday.com is Procter & Gamble's site, and you need to have a login on here um, to um, print these. And I don't know, I can't remember if these are limit one, maybe. <laughs> I can't remember. I, don't, I hardly ever print from here. And a lot of times these ones are identical to what's over on coupons.com. But you might find some PNG coupons on here that you're not finding elsewhere. Um, Kellogg's Family Rewards. Um, they have, you know, Kellogg's coupons to print. And you have to have a login. And if you redeem to get points for buying Kellogg's products... You can buy higher value coupons with um, with your points, and um, you know websites like Betty Crocker, um, you know L'Oreal, uh, Claritin, everybody, <laughs> all these companies have websites, and they're a lot of times they have coupons on there, so it's worth looking. A lot of the companies will put coupons on their Facebook page, so you might find that. And um, so, really, a good way to find websites that print that have coupons, or just to see if there's a coupon available, is to find yourself a coupon database, and you can just search on the internet "coupon database" and find a website that has them. There's a lot of blogs out there that have coupon databases. Um, and, you know, you can type in, you know, something like Claritin and it'll pop up different places that you can find Claritin coupons and they'll have links and it'll take you to a website to print the coupons. Because sometimes if you're looking for something obscure or you see somebody talk about something, a uh, coupon database is a good place to go <laughs> and figure out where that coupon came from. And oftentimes you can just search on the, you know, in, on the internet, just search for, uh, you know, $10 Claritin coupon and see if there's one available that way as well. Okay, so um, that's how you can print coupons from the internet.